I think one of my biggest highlights in 2017 was sitting in a barber shop in Hull, uh, getting my hair cut by a couple of 10 year olds um, as part of a Haircuts by Children by Malian Diving Reflex, um, which is a really interesting and quite thought provoking experience. Um, so yeah, this isn't that haircut. I think three of my really favourite shows from this year uh, were Collective Bustaki, uh, performing a really uh, really funny piece of kind of physical theatre, uh, which I also saw in Hull. Um, there was also uh, Equilibris by the Bolzini family, which is a fantastic, really thrilling uh, piece of classic high wire uh, artistry. Uh, and then there was also uh, The Adventures of Sneagle uh, by Caroline Bowditch, which I got to see at Just So Festival. Um, and it was a really lovely piece uh, for younger children, a very interactive kind of piece. My little boy absolutely loved it, so there are three of my real kind of uh, performance highlights from the year. In 2018, I'm really looking forward to a whole lot of new opportunities that I think are going to open up for the whole outdoor art sector. Um, in the space of 2017, we've seen a really big increase in support from the Arts Council of England, and I think that's given a real kind of confidence boost, and it's been a real, a, a real vote of confidence in the whole outdoor art sector. So I think there's a lot of kind of exciting things in the pipeline for next year, and I'm really looking forward to it.